what's up everybody welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for clicking on our video today we are always so happy and super super excited to have you guys here so if you're watching today's video kindly consider subscribing to the channel because it's totally free do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and family So in today's video let's talk about some of the things that you need to consider when choosing your wedding venue and we're gonna start off with what overnight accommodation does the venue have we had talked about some of the things on our previous video so if you haven't watched those videos kindly go back and watch it so that you're able to catch up she goes her own way like I don't give a damn girl and my god she owns it so many heartbreaks goes back to 2014 and i think that she knows it and if you've seen her i know that you would believe it cause i i know that you'd want her to yeah i do everyone's taking their shot but missing out on the cut so what overnight accommodation that uh, does the venue have with safety in mind and the strict drinking and driving laws in place uh, suitable overnight accommodation is very essential consideration when you're choosing your wedding venue guest accommodation on site or within close driving distance is even more important if you have guests coming from afar so a bridal suit or preparations room at the wedding venue is a must and this will also save you unnecessary tire travel time which means more time to spend with your favorite people on your wedding day. Jeans and tattoos on both her ankles, 21 pile of t-shirt, that's the stuff. Goddamn she's so fly, knows how to write a good song, at least better than this. Cause if you've seen her, I know that you would believe it, cause I, I know that you'd want her to. She knows that she drives them crazy when she's looking like that. The way she's moving makes them. You also need to ask the venue if there are other events on the day and make sure that you have exclusive use of the venue on your wedding day because the last thing you want is to compete with another couple for the best photo uh, spots or run out of parking space or guest accommodation but then again if you don't mind the above and uh, you want to save on cost sharing a venue might help lower cost and your ability to afford uh, the venue. Thank you. 
also the issue of catering and bar restrictions. Does your venue have a fully stocked kitchen that is open for use for the outside caterers? If not, you are restricted to the capabilities and menu offered by the in-house caterers. So make sure the venue has liquor license as this might, uh, this might also hugely affect the way your beverages are handled on the night. And if they do not have a license, then they most probably also do not have a bar and you will have to add extra cost to get a bar and staffing company to handle your beverages. Most venues will require you to make use of their bar facilities as this will generate extra income for them. Beware of the cost of the beverages as an open bar might add a huge amount onto your wedding cost. And also cockage is another consideration. How much will it cost to bring in your own wine and bubbly? If this cost is high then it might be worthwhile to opt for the wine on the menu and make sure that the wine offered by the estate is of the standard that you are happy with. And lastly, please find out whether the venue comes with waiters and bar staff and if not, what the cost will be to hire the additional staff to fulfill those functions. So guys, we'll be able to continue with more tips on uh, booking your venue and uh, things that you need to consider. So kindly consider subscribing, liking and sharing and I hope that I'll be able to see you on the next one. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for clicking on our video today. We are always so happy and super super excited to have you guys here. So if you're watching today's video, kindly consider subscribing to the channel because it's totally free. Do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and family. Mm -hmm. 